Maskelyne and Brad Switzerland hit back with a thunderous strike by Granite Xhaka and a last-minute breakaway goal by Jordan Shakiri to claim a famous 2-1 win over Serbia on Friday in a swashbuckling World Cup rupee match tinged with Balkan rivalry. The Swiss looked in danger of being overrun when Serbia went ahead with an Aleksandr Mitrovic header after five minutes to the delight of their fervent supporters at the Kaliningrad Stadium. Shaka silenced a Serbian contingent in the 52nd minute, however, when he rifled home a loose ball in spectacular style from 25 metres before Shakiri ran onto a through ball and finished with a plum to win the game at the death. Shaka and Shakiri are among several members of the Swiss squad who are of Kosovar heritage, which added an extra dimension to the match. Serbia refuses to recognize the independence of its former province Kosovo which broke away 10 years ago. It's clear that emotions were displayed up and I think we all need to steer away from politics and focus on this sport as a beautiful game that brings people together. Switzerland coach Vladimir Petkovic told reporters. There was also controversy in the 65th minute when Mitrovic appeared to be held down as he went for a cross but the referee waved play on and there was no video review. The result left Brazil, 2-0 winners over Costa Rica, top with 4 points, ahead of Switzerland on goal difference with Serbia on 3. Serbia must beat Brazil in their final game to qualify without relying on the result of the Swiss game against Costa Rica, who are eliminated after losing their first two games. This is football, we did not convert some of our chances, Serbia coach Milad and Kerstagic said. Whether this was a penalty or not, I will not comment on that. We are in a situation where we need a win against Brazil on and we will focus and do whatever we can to try and win. Nothing is impossible in life. Flying starter Bia made a flying start and Mitrovic forced Swiss goalkeeper Jan Sommer into an early save with a close-range header. Sommer was powerless, however, in the fifth minute when Nemanja Matic won the ball and found Dusan Tadic, whose cross was met with a soaring header from Mitrovic. With Mitrovic proving a handful for the Swiss defence, Serbia threatened to overrun their opponents and missed another chance when a corner flew across the face of goal and Dusko Tosic just failed to make contact. Switzerland came right back into the game seven minutes after halftime thanks to Shaka's fulminating strike after a rebound fell nicely into his path. Shaka was almost upstaged by Shakiri who clipped the crossbar with a curling, dipping shot from the unlikeliest of angles and the match turned into a pulsating end-to-end -end affair which was brilliantly settled by Shakiri. Switzerland cleared a Serbia attack a through pass sent the diminutive forward scuttling away before he slotted the ball neatly into the far corner. What is important is that we have developed this winning mentality even when we are down, said Petkovic, whose side have lost only one of their last 24 games. We always find a reaction. This is an important characteristic of my team, AP.